Tivoli is sold out. We are almost home. We have all of our farmer's market stuff and we left early today. So the farmer's market was a new one for us that we thought we'd try. It was what, 45 minutes to an hour away? 43 yes. miles from, from home. Um, started at eight, I think it goes till two and we left at about 11.20 or so. There was like not a lot of customers, not a lot of vendors, didn't sell one little baby chick. Thought we'd head home early. We're gonna unload these babies and go do something fun. All right, we went home, we unloaded all the farmer's market stuff, and we are now heading to... Uh, the Tabuli Fest. The Tabuli Fest in Bristow, Oklahoma. We are starving, and we're gonna go check it out and also get to see some of our friends while we're there. All right, we just made it to Bristow, Oklahoma. I am starving. What time is it? Is it probably two o'clock? I am so hungry. I could eat my arm or <laughs> I could eat a horse. 153. <laughs> Let's go get some food. You eat your arm. Well, I'm glad you would eat yours and not mine. See that? I see it. I see the logo. That's so awesome. Center stage. Junod Acres. Junods. <laughs> the Junods. How do we get over there? So we just spotted our friends the Junos and I'm most excited to see Poppy because he loves me and he likes to give me kisses. So we're going to go check them out over here. Oh my goodness. Is this Junot Acres? The first time Jason and Danielle came over and he's never All right, I found Poppy and Sam gave me some treats for him. Last time he gave me kisses. He's not very interested right now. Poppy, you want to give me a kiss? Poppy, you wanna, look what I've got for you. You want this? Poppy. Oh, he's so sweet. Look, Poppy. You want more? You want more? Poppy. No, I didn't pull it, but I loosened it. Like two turns, full turns. Right? Puffy, 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 puffy. One more, puffy, puffy, puffy. So first we got some nachos from our really good friend here. This was our neighbor over at Beeline. This is Mike and Sean. They have the corn dog and lemonade stand. I've heard that the tabbouleh is sold out. I heard the cabbage rolls might be sold out. So we're gonna walk down this way and see if there's any left. Sweet baby. All right.
right, it's time to pack up and go. And Ginger and Poppy are on their way home. Looking good. Poppy, not you, Flint. Oh, come on. It goes without saying with me, right? Yeah, right, right. So this trailer, you guys, this trailer is open so they could transport their camels. Isn't that so cool? Have you ever wondered how they get them in without hurting their head? Look. You see that? Yeah. He kneels down to get he, to get that. underneath that. That's so cool. It is tall, isn't it? Does he do that with all structures? To get through low areas? Yes, low areas. You did good at your debut. Come on, you ready to go home? just for me. That was romantic. Grab the poop bag and the shovel, baby. <laughs> Is this done? I just gotta push. Hold on. Gotta push on this so I can get the screw out. We came, we saw, we ate, and now it's time to go home. Did you have fun? Oh, yes. <laughs> Great times. You know, it's kind of just the same as anything else. I don't know if it was necessarily focused for tabbouleh, even though it's called that. There was a couple vendors that had some Lebanese food, but the rest was just like a street party. Um, lots of local boutiques and t-shirts, lemonade, corn dogs, that kind of thing, some barbecue. But it was for the most part, really nice. Say hi, Sean. Hi. But the whole town of Bristow is so nice. Like, look at these buildings. Look at that, Jeremy. It says for sale by owner. For sale by owner. I love that building. The downtown Bristow area is so cute. You see it? It's got all these old little brick buildings. I love it. I've always wanted to own a brick building, like in like a heart of America kind of town. Cyber truck. Yeah. We've seen a lot of those lately. I know, right? Yeah. We did not try the tabbouleh. No. We need to try it. Well, don't you have to have a chip or something? That's good. Oh, spoon, okay. You share a spoon with me? Sure. Here, you want to take the first dip? There you go first. Okay. So let's try this tabbouleh. Now we've had it before when we are at the lake once, I made it and Jeremy dipped Doritos in it and he really liked Doritos, but this is what it looks like. What would you say that smells like? Garlicky oil? Yeah. Any vinegar, vinegar smell? Maybe a little bit. Onion. Cilantro, parsley, parsley. It's good. Hmm. I know you're not huge on tabbouleh. Not huge. But it's pretty good. Yeah, I could just eat that by itself. Not bad. Mm -mm. Not bad. You guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. Thanks for coming along. 
on our adventure to the Tabuli Fest in Bristow, we really were coming just to see the Junos and it's kind of cool to be able to bring this home to the boys and say, we got you this in Bristow. But thank you so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, hit the little subscribe button. Hit the little alert button. It'll alert you every single time we upload a new video. Share with your friends. Take this video and share it with everybody you know. If you want to see what Route 66 looks like in the middle of Bristow, now's your chance. Thank you again for coming and watching. Hope you guys have a good weekend. Bye-bye.